people it's the first clip of the week and it's the beginning of the last of the things that I get to do with my brother at my work because my brother is moving on to other things and the fun that we have at work is coming to an end because he's quitting this is last week there I'm actually rather sad about it my brother doesn't understand but uh, work, you know, that's our time. That's that's the time me and him get to hang out and just have fun, mess with each other, enjoy each other's company uh, with no grumpy people around or other friends that want attention. But it's all going away. Uh, it's an improvement for me. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad it's a step up for you. I'm happy for you. No, I'm not. Yeah. Opportunities abound for you, brother. So, but this is gonna suck though if uh, if all this backfires on you, huh? Why would it backfire? I don't know. Un Why would you be a naysayer? Thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm, it's my job to be a naysayer. I'm well aware. Ah, so we're on our way to work. It's like 5:30. No, oh, it's 5:31. And that's it. All I want to share with you. Bye. All right, people. If I wind up missing, dead, or just no longer vlogging in the future, ever in the future, ever. Uh, it's because my brother, who claimed and said he was gonna do this just a few days ago, that he thought about doing it, was gonna grab his gun, go upstairs, shoot dad first. No, he said he was gonna shoot me, then shoot dad, then David, then Gabriel, and then off himself. I didn't say that. Oh, you didn't say the last part? Only if the North Koreans were invading. Uh, what? <laughs> so he admits he did say that now. No, I did not. Yes, he did. Investigate him. <laughs> oh, I feel bad for them. Look at them. They're all like, "Fuck, we know this is this is the I'm end." Be eating you later. Thank you. Oh, I feel bad for them. Look at that. You can see it in their eyes. Like, <laughs> like no, I don't want to go. <laughs> Poor guys, I feel bad for y'all. I feel bad for you guys, I do. I'm Not sorry. Me. Eat turkey bacon. <laughs> Brother. Check out this dude's license plate. <laughs> Creative. My brother finds it hilarious. Don't you, brother? These nuts. I am actually supposed to be at work, but I saw this turtle on our way over here that was stuck in the uh, on the side of the road. I was like, hey brother, we should stop and get it and save it. He's like, man, fuck that turtle. So I decided to walk over here and try and get the turtle myself. Hopefully it doesn't it didn't get hit already. I'll get back to you. So I'm gonna go ahead and move him over that way, so he doesn't get himself hit. I moved him. <laughs> now I'm probably gonna be like a minute or two late to work. Got a head walking. People, it's alive! My brother finally got this thing completely back up to snuff. All he's gotta do is put uh, the bumpers back on. But it's been a while. Like what, two months now? Yay! That's your local Harbor Freight. My brother lost his. Lost your tool going down the road like an idiot. Probably could have went back and looked for it. Probably. Probably still could. What was it going to do? Probably still could. Sup, my peoples? It's been a pretty good couple days. Uh, I haven't gotten too many clips in. Well, not too many long clips. Got plenty of clips, though. Uh, you know what? The new expansion for Destiny comes out uh, in like two days. So that's pretty cute. I forgot my freaking glasses, so I feel blind now. I'm just squinting everywhere. On my way to work, if it wasn't obvious. Uh, we went and exchanged that little hot spot. I don't know if I've shown you guys yet. 
But uh, got a little hot spot uh, night gear net or Nighthawk uh, mobile hot spot. Uh, I exchanged it because it wasn't really working all that great. So I exchanged it for another one. Maybe it was that device. And then I ordered an antenna on Amazon. I should get that on Monday. Uh, hopefully that'll boost my uh, internet speeds. And then I should be able to uh, upload when I'm at home. Right now I've been just uploading all the videos at work. Uh, my brother finally got the truck working. Yep, even though it has no bumpers right now. My brother's ghetto. This truck sucks. Uh, let's see. Tomorrow is the last day my brother is working here. And then I'll be working here on my own. I got I got a zit right there or something. Ow. It's making me self-conscious right now. I keep looking at it. Uh, there's a lot of Mustangs around today because there's like a Mustang rally down the road here. Uh, and yesterday there was a lot more too. Uh, great day outside. I met the guy that uh, is like the general manager or something of the uh, Coca-Cola plant out here when I was at the ATM. That was pretty interesting, actually, because uh, he's, he's a pretty friendly guy. Just telling me how he got neck surgery, and so he, that was over with. He's trying to get out and go do some stuff because it's a nice day. He wants to go try and stretch his neck a little. Uh, there, there's the there's a Dorcas over there. What's up, Dorcas? Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, having a hard time getting in, big boy. I feel good, man. Here, what's up? I said I don't feel good. Yeah, my poor brother, man. He, he's not feeling so well. He's uh, not handling it like a man would. Anyways, talk to you guys later. See you on the next clip. At the hospital, visiting our dad's new residence. Until tomorrow. Then he comes back to be grumpy at home again. Okay. <laughs> What's up, Gabriel? I guess dad is suffering from pneumonia. I think he's suffering from a case of... The grumps. What? Like a dog would hurt. What leg, brother? What's this do? And then right when it stops, you got to go. You got to jump. Did you feel it? No. no. Wait, what's this? Oh, okay. My poor brother, he's been feeling sick the past couple days. Okay, we don't Well, yeah. That's what are those? Those, you know what that is. You weirdo. Dad doesn't like being filmed, so bye. Just imagine a roof on top of it. Yeah. No, that's, I was in one of these as a kid, and I figured out how to open it, and it almost broke my arm when I was just like a toddler, pretty much. And we're off to work now. This is probably the last clip of the day, you guys, or of the week, you guys, so, uh, Thanks for joining me on this journey this week. Hey, there was a hot the nurse. Her name was Kelly. She's pretty hot. Hey, Zeus. Hey, Zeus. Oh. Uh, Just hanging around. <laughs> that's messed up. Well, till next week. Later, dudes. Up, oh, peeps. I decided to make another clip. And hope that I can catch a little bit of lightning in those clouds over there while I'm doing it. So it'll probably be a, wa a bit of a wasteful clip where I'm not really talking about anything that matters. <laughs> uh, tonight is the last night my brother is going to be working at Uni at Laser Spot. Uh, and I'm a little bummed about that. You know, he's my... I, I like being around my brother, you know? Even if it makes him a little uncomfortable that I like being around him so much. Too bad for him. <laughs> Let's see if we can zoom in a little bit more. Too bad there's a stupid light pole right in the middle of it. Where I'm standing, it smells like someone's pissed here recently. Gross. Ah. Uh, yeah, I'm a little bummed. My brother, he's going to move on to bigger and better things. You know, I might move I might move on to bigger and better things, too. But I kind of like my job. We'll see, though. Uh, my brother's planning on moving out, possibly, in a few months. 
into his own place. I was hoping that uh, we'd be getting a, a place together, you know, allow me to continue uh, paying a little bit less rent uh, because we'd all be splitting it and stuff. But if my brother wants to move into his own place, I got to kind of figure out my own thing too. Uh, I have an option where I could stay where I'm at while he moves away, but I don't really want to stay there. Uh, so I'm going to try and see what I can figure out. My brother pointed out that I might not be able to afford much of a place if I'm paying $500 a month for a vehicle, uh, already. Now, I, I think I should be able to. I mean, I make, uh, shoot, I make like 15, 14, between 14 and 1600 a month. Um, if I get a place for like 500 with like $200 in bills, uh, so that's 700 plus 500, you know, I might not be able to, you might be right. Uh, unless I got another roommate, which I kind of don't want to do that. I kind of just want to get my own place. I keep on getting places where I have roommates and like my brother, I would kind of just like to move into my own place as well, you know? Not have to bunk up with anybody anymore. Do what I want in my own place. Just be me, you know? Uh, so, yeah, I mean, I understand what he wants, and I empathize there. It's just kind of a bummer because, you know, kind of like living with him. Uh, you know, I just got a hold of... Uh, a really old TV show, not really old, <laughs> to me it's old, uh, it's in the 90s, early, early 90s, like 91, 1990 or 91, I believe, it is, that I didn't know existed until yesterday, uh, and they don't have any DVDs of it, and as far as I know, I've never heard of a VHS of it or anything like that, because it was such a short-lived, only seven episodes they ended up making, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventures, the live-action TV series. Uh, so I found that on YouTube. They were all broken up into like little short segments and all over the place. Uh, so I ended up gathering them all up, all the episodes, downloading them, converting them into single files, and then, uh, putting the proper naming structure for each one. Like I went and searched down all the episode titles and stuff and created a, a little collection of them. So now I have them all in order and yeah as they should be which i doubt very many people in this world have i wonder if i get in trouble for shit if i shared that with people i don't know though because uh it's such an obscure show it might not really i probably would so i probably won't share it with nobody uh, except for like friends or family I'd give them a copy of it because i don't think you can get it anywhere right now but anywho yeah i was gonna say just saying that i found that that's pretty cool i'm gonna watch it uh, it's clearly very terrible, but then again, it's Bill and Ted, but it's a classic, man. Classic, classic 90s stuff. You know, I realize I'm a very 90s guy. I love the 90s. I miss the 90s. Bring back the 90s. That's, that's, that's my motto. Bring back the 90s. <laughs> Anywho, uh, I guess I can't really justify keeping this thing going on forever. So this is the last clip. Talk to you guys later. See you next week. So you got anything you want to say for the for the vloggers out there? Or, well, for the watchers? The only thing that sucks is I can't jerk off like I used to. <laughs> I got to go work in a cubicle. Damn it, brother. I got to be weird and creepy. It's all right. It's better than the last it's clip. It's always fun jerking off at work. I'm getting money while I'm in Oh, my money. gosh. What if your new job, like, looks at my vlogs and stuff and they see you saying stuff like that? They probably won't look at your vlog. Yeah, nobody does. Yeah. <sighs> Not even my own family. I look at it. Occasionally to see if I'm talking crap about Gabe. <laughs> yeah, I know why you watch you it. Do. Not so much here lately, but... Hey, I've been getting along with Gabe recently. That's great, man. You should. Even when he picks on my dog, I still be nice to him. He's the freedom of my loins. That's disgusting. That's true. It's disturbing. Maybe someday I'll have a couple fruits. <laughs> <laughs> might be fungus growing up from the fucking floor.
Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> Nasty, dude. <laughs> this is why you should stop smoking. Oh. Whatever. It's been a little stormy tonight. I was supposed to have the last clip, a couple clips ago. I thought I'd add a clip on the end because I thought my brother was going to say something, you know, memorable for the vlog. Like, yeah, I'm leaving the, I'm, <laughs> he looks like a freaking idiot right now. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, well, we'll end that you guys later. Weird.